What is going on guys? Giganato Gaming here and we are back with a brand new <clears throat> Ark Survival Evolved or Ascended series. Today's video, we are in a new map. The new update has dropped and we are now on a brand new map, the the center map, I think it is, which adds in <clears throat> a lot of stuff. A brand new map as well as new creatures like the Shastasaurus and a surprise creature known as the the Pyromane, I think it's called. <clears throat> now, the Pyromane you had to pay for, it's like $5, but the Shastasaurus is free and comes with the DLC. Now let's start with Tropical Island South, I guess. <clears throat> I guess we'll spawn here for the time being. So don't worry, you guys. Arcology, I haven't abandoned that yet. I'm still doing this. This will probably coincide with it. I'll be doing these two series at the same time. So I'll probably alternate between the two series. I'll do an episode of this, and then I'll do an episode of... I am already in love with this place. Then I'll do an episode of Arcology, and then we'll go from there. Oh, I'm seeing some prehistoric beasts creatures on here already. So this is the center map, everybody. This is so cool. Already I'm loving this. All right. Let's try to level up a little bit. A 130 Sintao. Do I have to be... I have to put... I could just put taming food in you. All right. Let me see if I can collect some berries real quick. So yeah, this is a brand new series. And don't worry, the old series hasn't been abandoned. I'm just... Already a Bronto's getting attacked by a T-Rex already. All right, let's see if we can, you know, feed you this these berries... This is a 130 Centausaurus. Alright, 35%. I think you're gonna take about two more. <clears throat> I think that's an Arcology Bronto. That's not even a regular Bronto. So these creatures do spawn on here. Which is very good to know. Oh no, Dillo. Don't don't attack my whatever. Uh, yeah, he's gonna attack it. Yep. Oh, he's just standing there. So yeah, that's what I'll do. I'll alternate between the two series. I can't believe there's a T-Rex over there already. Alright, so I think our first objective is just to tame something that we can ride and build our very first base. Alright, well, we'll see what this Dillo does. I don't know if you're going to attack it or whatever. Yep, he attacked the Sintau. Yep, I figured he would. Alright, <clears throat> let's focus on making some weapons. We'll get the campfire, we'll get the spear, the hatchet, and some clothes. We should be good on that. There we go. Alright, I just wanted to hop right into the center map, which looks gorgeous. Honestly, I'm amazed none of my mods have crashed and some of the creatures from the mods are spawning here. I'm honestly amazed by that. <clears throat> then again, I have given it a day or two to try and, you know, do whatever. Alright, first things first, let's make a... A pick. We just need a bit more thatch to make the pick. That should be fine. Uh, shame we couldn't tame that Sintow right off the bat. That was like a 130. Alright, let's get the pick. We got a lasso. <clears throat> let's level up a little more. Alright, let's get this. So we should have a pick now. We should be able to make some flint. Get some flint so we can make ourselves another saddle. Hello, baby Dillo. How do you do? You're an Arcology, Dillo. I can tame you. Okay, I've tamed you. I don't know if you're going to survive or not, but... I've tamed a couple of them. Well, there's a D-Arc. I'd love to tame one of you. Alright, I don't, I don't have a, a hatchet yet. Alright, let me give you half of this meat, and then I'll give you the other half. <clears throat> we got two Dillos right off the bat. They're both mutated as well. That's cool, I guess. They only got about 300 health, so they shouldn't be... You want to walk? And... Okay. Alright, let me just take you guys out for a walk. Alright, you're fully grown. And you want to cuddle. Alright, we have one imprinted Dillo anyway. So that should be good. You know what? That'll make gathering hide a little bit easier. Alright, a trike might be a death wish. So might a, 
a turtle. What level are you? 130. Yeah, 130. That's definitely a death wish. Now, the Shastasaur, they basically spawn anywhere in the ocean. They're very easy to tame. Well, very easy to find, anyway. I don't know about tame. Alright, Dillos. Ow! Seagull. A seagull just stole my berries. Oh, no. Trikes. Uh, passive. 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 A trike's after us. Alright, run, you guys. Run. 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 Just run. We hit the trike by accident. Alright, Seagull, can you do me a favor and leave me alone? I'm trying to survive out here. There you go. Good boys. Are you boys? No. Girls. Good girls. Alright. Ooh, is that another Dillo? Another baby Dillo that we can add to the army. We got three Dillos. I don't know what to do here. There's a T-Rex right there. I don't want to anger that trike again. I don't want to anger that D-Arc either. Oh. Alright, kill that Parasaur. That was a 135. Damn. <clears throat> and we killed the Ichthyornis. Awesome. Alright, so we've got three Dillos right off the bat. Which we all raised as babies. Alright. Alright. I don't know if we should take that trike or not. What level is this trike? If you're like a low level, then maybe. 135. Yeah, we're not going after that. Actually, I might even tame that later on. Now, let's go this way, away from the T-Rex. We're going to get plenty of hide from this. Uh, can we, can we please attack the Dodo? Look at that. We got a Dillo army going so far. Right off the bat, that actually makes gathering hide a lot easier. Alright, let's find a place to call home. What, what is that? What is that? I don't want to know what that is. I really don't want to know. Alright, we got a couple of D-Arcs. We need that flute in order to tame one. When can we get the flute? Level 50? Well, luckily our, our rates are pretty high, so... Let's go up in stamina a little bit. We're only level 11, so we won't be able to get the D-Arcs just yet. I right, found another Dillo. Or, sorry, another Parasaur. Attack that Parasaur, you guys. Uh... What are you guys doing? Hey, hey! Where are you going? Killed a, a Dillo. You know, I'm gonna take this Parasaur. We're, we're on a roll. So far, we've got three Dillos and a Parasaur. This is good. We got a level 85 Parasaur and not the highest level Dillos. We got two level 52s and a level 25. Oh, Medjoberry. I actually had that. We got a fully imprinted Parasaur. Right, let me gather some berries so I can get this going. We might be able to get a Parasaur saddle right off the bat. We've got a lot of the same mods on here as we did in Arcology. Just like with the other one, this will be a more chill series. Alright, we've got a Listro. We've got quite a few Dodos. A 140 Dodo, 25. The center's known for a lot of high levels. A 100 Listro and a level 90 Dodo. We're actually doing pretty well, considering. We just tamed three Dillos and a Parasaur right off the bat. That's, that's incredible. That is very incredible, if I do say so myself. Sometimes I think I'm a god. I think I'm him. Alright, what do we need more of? We need a bit more fiber. Because I want to get at least three of them. At least three... Spears. I'm comfortable with three. Anything special? Alright, let me just collect all the hide we've gotten. Ooh, we got so much hide from this. And another 24 from you. So altogether, that's 105. 105 hide that we can use. Alright, let's see. Parasaur saddle. Let's track that. Just need a bit of fiber. That's literally all we need. We've got the hide. We've got the fiber. But once we get the saddle for the Parasaur, that should make gathering berries a lot easier. Alright, we got 
We got plenty of berries, I think. Yeah, we've got enough berries to last us a lifetime. And we've got some wood, some thatch. What should we do with this? Um, let's start making our little house. Let's get some thatch going. We don't have a sickle. A moss chops would be super nice to have. Because that would make gathering fiber so much easier. Yeah, it's basically fiber we need. Alright, well, we got a general idea anyway. Alright, let's go exploring on the Parasaur. The reason he's low health is because I've been leveling him up. Yo, this is looking fire, I'm not gonna lie. Looking real fire. You are a beautiful D-Arc! Holy crap! Hello, you beautiful thing. What level are you? 95? Not a bad level. You know what? I might tame you. I might try to tame you. Is that a drop? If that's a drop, then we'll see what's in it. Hopefully we don't get ambushed by any raptors or anything like that. I have to be level 25. Damn it! What level am I? 23. Only two more levels. If we can, if we can rack up two more levels... Real quick, before that drop disappears. Holy mother of dillos. We got some pants anyway. You know what, we'll take it. We got some pants anyway. Yeah, it might be a little hot, but who, who cares? At least I've got something to cover me up. Yo. Are those dillos? No, those are raptors. They just absolutely destroyed that Bronto. Okay, we're not going that way. Those weren't Dillos, those were Raptors. We are imprinted, right? Yeah, we are imprinted. But even so, let me up the melee just so we can at least fight back. All right, next on our list is to try and get a fiber gatherer, like a Moss Chops. Hello, Diark. Wait, am I level 50 yet? Can I make that? No, I'm 31. So yeah, I'll probably alternate between this series and the Arcology series. That's what I'll do. I couldn't afford to do that on Ascended or Evolved even. Because once I did it in Evolved, the game would crash every time I try to play a new game. But not here. I guess we'll make... Three more for the time being. We can we can always expand at some point. Once we get like a moss chops going, then we can always expand. What I'm hoping is a raptor doesn't jump out through there. That's what I'm hoping. Alright. Well, we've got a parasaur for the time being. With the saddle and whatever. We're actually doing pretty well considering. Considering we literally just started this. Alright, we got a door going. Let's get a wall. And then let's put the door away. Alright, there we go. We need basically six more walls and four ceilings. We could start working on the ceilings. There we go. Alright. Let's keep track of what we need. Fiber, of course it is. Of course it's fiber we need. I don't think we'll be able to... That better be a Bronto that just knocked down that tree. Because if that was a T-Rex, I will be super annoyed. I mean, I could try to have the Dillos fight it. I mean, we got three Dillos. They're not the greatest level. But, I mean, I could level them up to make them killing machines. I'll put half of your levels in the health and the other half in the melee. There we go. I made them a little bit stronger anyway. All right. So if they have to fight a T-Rex or something, then I don't know about a T-Rex, but like a, a raptor, I'm pretty sure they can take on a single raptor. Maybe not that raptor pack that we witnessed, but they can definitely take on a single raptor. Alright, how much fiber do we have? 139. Alright, do we have enough for six walls? We have enough for 19 walls. Okay, good. Let's make six of those. This is good for now. All right, you guys can follow me back to base. You guys can follow back. If you want. All right, there we go. How you doing on hide? 26. All right, we've got more than enough. Way more than enough. 
All right, we got some very strong pants, which we should probably save for the snow biome. If I'm gonna be honest. All right, we should be good. We managed to survive an entire day. All right, really? I can't get into my house? Really? All right, well, let's get the cosmetic anyway. Okay, I did not mean to craft that. Well, let's get the ramp going. Let's change those into stairs. And then give you the... The Bob's Tall Tales treatment. There we go. Our place is looking great. So now, before we end the episode off... I'd like to take some Tinto Berries and do I have any Mejos? Oh, they're in my Zero slot. Alright. And some Mejos, just in case we end up finding a Moss Chops. Yeah, there's... There's something up there. I kind of don't want to know what it is. Alright, let's disable snapping so I can put this wherever I want. Let's put the Narco Berries in here. We got some more Narco Berries. We just need some spoiled meat. Some spoiled meat would be super nice. You know what would also be nice? A banana sword. We've got stimulant, but not narcotic. Hello, trike. Split all. You leave me alone, I'll leave you alone. Simple as that. Hello, baby trike. Yeah, there's like an alpha up there. Ah, part of me wants to investigate. You guys stay there. Part of me wants to investigate what's going on. An Alpha Dillo. Okay. I'm pretty sure we can take that. Alpha Dillos are from the Arcology mod. I would say they're probably the weakest Alphas out there. Let me kill you. Yeah, a thousand. Yeah, we just absolutely destroyed that. And we got 28 levels from it as well. Alright. That was... I had nothing to worry about there. Honestly, I had nothing to worry about. All right. So now we're doing like a thousand damage per. So we could take on the trike if we wanted to, but I'm not going to. The trike can... The seagull, on the other hand, can piss off. You didn't just destroy my motor and pestle, did you? Come down and fight me like a bird. Come down and fight me. Yeah, screw you. I'm just gonna wait for this meat to spoil. Let me up the gamma so I can see. Because it's getting dark out. We got a lot done this episode. We tamed three Dilophosaurs. And we tamed a Parasaur. All in the same episode. And got a saddle for it. Alright, let's go ahead and make as much narcotic as we can. And then while that crafts... Let me get some levels. We got 45 levels from that. Yeah, we'll, we'll certainly have enough levels for... Alright, let's get that up to 500 health, and then we'll get that to 500 weight. We're level 79. If we wanted to, we could get a Rex Saddle. Alright, what I kind of want to do is get an awesome Spyglass as well. And I want to see if we can get a Moss Chop. So if we got... Yeah, we got some berries on us. Let's see if we can go get that. I don't think I'm ready for a pack of raptors. These turtles are friendly, right? I know in ASC they're not, but in ASA I think they are. Wait, what are these? Are those geckos? They are geckos. You know what? I could do for a shoulder pet. I think these were the guys I'm talking about. Do I have any meat on me? <sighs> Crap. I don't think I do. You do have a baby, though. So maybe if I kill you and get your baby? Oh! I was gonna passively tame you, but... Here, baby. Alright, I think that's a T-Rex attacking the Brontos. I'm gonna have a little shoulder pet. Oh, something you should know about the Rainbow Gecko. These guys here, I was talking about them in a previous episode of Arcology. But these guys grant you oxygen, like unlimited oxygen, so there's no need for scuba gear. You can swim faster as well, you get more oxygen. We got the gecko, let's get him out of here. You see, there's this water vision buff. Like, basically what happens with this creature is that it allows you to, like, go underwater and whatever. 
You know, let's test that out real quick before before we end the episode off. All right, so we got ourselves a gecko, three dillos, and a parasaur this episode. Pretty cool. All right, let's test out this uh, water buff that we get from this guy. Yeah, see, we can swim very quickly, and we have an unlimited amount of oxygen. Look at that. Our oxygen's not dropping at all. Yeah, these guys are really good for underwater adventures. All right, and with that, that's going to have to wrap it up for this episode. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. But until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.